Hi guys, good morning. So I'm Arlene from the Philippines and as you can see I'm outside again because I'm checking a 5 hectare property located here in Santo Turibio, Lipa City and the good thing about this property it is overlooking the mountain and it is directly by the road so let's check it out, okay? So as you can see on my background that is already the Barangay Road and let's wait for the people to pass, okay? Because uh, kind of traffic so let's check it out and as you know Santo Toribio is uh, 11 kilometers away from Lipa City town proper where you can have the shopping malls the groceries SNR schools hospital and everything so it's worth checking out okay so let's go so let's check so this is the boundary of the property and I will stay here on the other side of the road. So it's called Matthew's Farm. As you can see, you have a very wide frontage over here. The gate is already big, so it can pass directly two cars. And it will go that way. So uh, later, I have to save the location. So I can send you guys the Google map link because sometimes I forget about it and then I have to go back to the same area and it's you know sometimes I don't remember it okay so this ends here here so the next property is also a farm so that is also a farm and that is going down to Santo Toribio and that road is going directly to Lipa City Okay, so the frontage more or less is like, I think, uh, 60 meter or more. So let's check it out. And yeah, it's actually on the left side of the road when I'm going to Lipa. And it's quite elevated because I've noticed, I've noticed that the right side of the road is quite low so in that way you have more more to see on this side of the property so as well you will see the mountain so because the gate is locked I have to go through this area which is going through the barbed wire okay so let us check but uh, guys we have permission to go inside the property right so as you can see over here we have already the barbed wire here so it's actually safe and then you have a big acacia tree over there and you see already the fence that is the boundary of the property and your neighbor will be a farm as well planted with cassava and at the moment it's being planted I don't know with what but you can see they have some coconut trees over here so the good thing about this property it's already fenced so you can already see your borders so that's a good thing and it's yeah the next lots are like farms so you don't have too many neighbors right so that is the gate going through the gate so the gate is like that and yeah up to that side of the property you can see the fence so it's actually very big so five hectares is equal to 50,000 square meter about this property is you have a very clear view of the mountain guys look at that you know you cannot move the mountain so here you have a perfect view so if you have a house where I am standing now so I am standing in it's actually not in the middle of the property it's actually one third of the property it's 
very windy and I have really a direct view of the mountain and guys it's perfect so if you are looking for something like this then I think this is the property for you and yeah it's affordable so I will I will put in the description box later or in the pinned comment section the price of the property so in that way you you have a clear view where you will check the prices right so let's check the view so that is Mount Malarayat guys that is Mount Malarayat it's perfect so let's check so they have as well Guyabano tree over here and they have mango trees over there so ins and mango trees and as you can see over there that's still part of the property but I think it's planted with corns. Kuya, may isa ang tanim? Ha? Anong tanim nito? Uh, ay, 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 wala pa yan. Wala pa yan. Tanim. It's not yet planted, guys. Sorry. So, that is Mount Valaret, guys. So, don't miss the view. So, hanggang doon sa may mga puno na yan, di ba? Oo. Oh, oh. So, as you can see, yeah, where you can see the trees, that is the border. And on the side of here as well, you can see the trees that is your borderline so they have somewhat a uh, an old shack over here most probably for caretakers so but if you buy the property you can just uh, dispose it right and it's really nice that is the whole property guys i think you will agree with me that the selling point here is the is the view and aside from the fact that it's very close to lipa city it's like 11 kilometers away and it's directly by the road if you are into farm life there is not there is not so many neighbors here and from where i am standing i think before there was a house here but now it's not existing anymore so in that way i'm quite elevated so it's really nice i really like this place you know and it's very quiet you don't have neighbors still you have electricity and water access um, internet connection they say PLDT already surveyed the area so but they are waiting for the small bridge to be built totally over in in the boundary near between San Celestino and Santo Toribio so in the next two years there will be PLDT fiber internet connection here so it's really worth and guys as you know Lipa City is one of the third coolest place in the Philippines and as well the the market value of the property here is increasing every year so when you want to invest and you want to see nature i think this is the perfect place for you guys so i'm not lying this is really the view take a look around i'm standing kuya is hiding it's really nice guys so guys again this 50,000 square meter property or 5, 5 hectare property is located in Barangay Santo Toribio, Lipa City it's 11 kilometers away from Lipa City town proper it's directly by the road it is electricity and water access and you will find the price of this property in the description box or in the comment section below with the pinned comment and thank you so much guys for watching don't forget to subscribe like and share and if you have any questions inquiries or whatever suggestion or anything don't hesitate to write me you can contact me via facebook as well with arlene Lewandowski. so thank you guys bye